here is the number one tip I have for you if you ever want to appendix carry. Uh, I don't I don't necessarily use the appendix carry. That's not like a, a thing of mine. I don't, I'm not a big fan of that at all. At all. Like I'm I'm not a big fan of it, but sometimes, hey, you might need to do it. You know, you might have a tighter shirt or whatever the case is. So this is what I'll say to you. Well, first of all, let's do everything. Let's just make everything safe or whatever the case is. This is a good tip too. You, I, I'll show you what I'm talking about. But essentially, what you could do is, if let's just say you're not using your arm for anything, your firearm for anything. All right. If you're gonna take your firearm out, just for just you know you want to put it away, put it in your safe. Take the whole holster out. Okay. And we just do this. Sorry, I'm pointing at you guys. There's nothing behind. It. It's just me in the room or whatever the case is all right so i'm gonna go ahead and make safe as you can see safe there's nothing in the mag well anything like that safe safe it's not pointing at me it's safe okay safe everything's safe all right so if you want to carry appendix here's the tip Put your firearm in the holster before you put it in your appendix area. So here's the tip again. Arm in holster before. Then you put it appendix like so. Then you cover. And that's the tip. That's the simple tip you want to carry appendix. This way you don't have to worry about re you know hold, loading them uh putting a load of weapon in, in your crotch area or you know any kind of accidents or whatever the case is. You already let me show it again. Put your arm in the holster beforehand. And then you put it appendix. For me, that's much more safer much more agreeable and you don't have to worry about accidentally anything going off in other regions. <laughs> Enjoy your firearm responsibly.